Good morning. Today we are starting off with some quiet weather and mild temperatures too and good view of downtown Fargo here this morning on our Storm Team Skycam network. And it's just a continuation of what has been a lovely 24 hours, I think, for most people. Our temperatures soared yesterday into the 70s. I was hoping to get to 70 in a couple of spots, but and we all did. We all warmed up into some low 70s to even mid 70s. Grand Forks hit 76, and that is a record high for Grand Forks. So that's how warm we were. We were breaking records, so we're on the warm side of things now uh, for one day yesterday with that sunshine. It just turned out to be a beautiful day. 73 in Fargo. Now this morning we're still on the warm side of things. We're looking at temperatures starting off in the 40s to about 50 degrees, which is pretty mild for this time of year and time of day. We're at 50 in Detroit Lakes and 50 in Bidette. It's 49 in Fargo. The thing that's changing though is we've got a wind shift happening. We're starting to see a front move through and you can see the wind becoming northwesterly there and that's going to start in the process, the cooling process, uh, bringing in cooler air out of the northwest and the winds will be pretty strong today too as that happens. So with that change we'll see some cloud cover sweeping through here this morning. You can see it's already up in northwest Minnesota and back over into northeastern North Dakota, just that northwestern corner. And Fargo still under some starry skies here this morning, but eventually this will drop to the south and east and we'll see some clouds for a couple of hours at least here today. Here's a look at that hour by hour planner. There's that cloud deck that's going to move to the southeast so around nine o'clock. We may be looking at clouds in the east and in the south and then that continues to move on and we see more sunshine later on. So at least we'll end up with a dry day and one that will feature some sunshine here. Uh, temperatures though not changing much. We'll be into the low 50s as we head into the noon hour but check out these winds steady in the 20s gusting into the 30s even 40s possible. So it's going to be a windy day and we are looking at temperatures that are running about 15 to 20 degrees cooler than yesterday into the 50s. This is actually closer to average uh, but we did warm up so much yesterday that this will feel pretty chilly. 56 in Fargo around 4 o'clock, 52 in Grand Forks. And then here comes the moisture. We're going to see that chance for some rain up north later this evening and into the late night hours tonight. Some rain, maybe some snow mixing in there too with temperatures cooling down. And this will continue to switch over and just kind of drop south overnight tonight. So late tonight and into early tomorrow, we'll see a chance for a little rain or some snow in the Southern Valley. It's a fast mover, so it's not going to drench us too much, but enough to be a nuisance for anybody's out in it and we may be dealing with a little bit of light snow into the early part of the day tomorrow as well. That should clear out pretty quickly though. So here's a look at your planner for Saturday. A cool one. You're going to want to bundle up if you're tailgating a high of 44 but before the game we'll probably be in the 30s and then for Sunday back into some 50s and we stay in those 50s for uh, next week as well. So not bad for fall. Uh, this forecast is looking pretty good and dry too for those farmers as well. We're just kind of all over the place, so 70 <laughs> yesterday, and up, then I down. heard you say snow for parts, like Mother Nature, make up your mind. It's that transition season, you know, we go back and forth, and eventually we know where we'll end up here in the next month or so. Most definitely. Thank you, Lisa.